What's up, sexies? Happy Tuesday. Man, that's glorious. It's gorgeous out here. I'll tell you what. And uh, again, apologies for yesterday. Some things, you know, need to be explained, and sometimes not everybody's got a voice, so I gotta stand up for what's good and what's right within everybody. Open eyes, let people understand that it's as cold as you want it to be out here. But, in light of that, let's uh, talk about that past. You know, it's the past for a reason. It needs to stay there. It doesn't belong anywhere in anybody's future. You know, but we all have one. And, you know, that's probably the toughest part is knowing everything that we've been through in our lives and and how some things have held us back, some things have kept us from, from going and being where we want to be and doing the things that we want to do. Man, we can't, we can't dwell on it. We can't continue to be in that state of past because if you stand there thinking about it and worrying about it, you never move forward. And I think that's one of the hardest things to try to overcome especially because everybody always likes to remind us of the past you know that's not for them to say not for them to judge they have no right to be honest with you and we need to stand up for ourselves we need to talk to these people who who continually bring it up who continually take us back all this forward progress we made and you continue to drag us back to the past We've got to stand up and say something. I don't, it's not easy, and there's some people that, you know, are going to be the way they're going to be no matter what. And you can't change any of that. It, it is what it is. But hopefully, someone in their right mind who is a good friend, hopefully a family member, would totally understand and would appreciate that and stop bringing it up. Because we all know how hard it is to get past that relationship, how hard it is to get past that loss, how hard it is to get past the things that we sabotaged our own selves on. We know, trust us, we see where we're at right now. We don't need to be constantly reminded. And that's one of the biggest killers of, of any kind of future, of your goals, of progress, of, of any of that. Is that simple fact that everyone continues to bring it up. No one wants to just leave it there. You know, it's so hard to move forward and build on what you have when everyone keeps taking you back to the past. Even yourself, your own mind, take a hold of you. You know, you got those simple little triggers here, there, and everywhere in life. And, man, you're your own worst enemy. Truly. You can very well be your own worst enemy. Don't get me wrong, people help a lot. <laughs> but the past, the past is something we have to forgive ourselves for, for our own mistakes, for our own actions, whatever it may have cost us back then. Know that in order to push forward, in order to start new growth, to enjoy a beautiful new life, you got to let the past go. You gotta leave it behind you. You gotta stop turning around and looking at it. Your goals should be ahead of you. Everything should be in front of you. It's time to stop looking back. It's time to stop letting them hold us back and dwell on it. The past is a killer. One of the biggest killers of any kind of motivation, of anything you could ever go through in your life. The past is daunting because it reminds us of all the mistakes, we, mistakes that we've made. And it keeps us locked in our own minds. The past is our prison, but we hold the keys to set ourselves free. So don't put it in the hands of others. Leave the past behind you because that's where it belongs. It has nothing to do with moving forward. You may learn some lessons from it, but take just that from it. Don't dwell upon it. Don't live in it. Don't relinquish yourself and your future because of it. You deserve the best. 
because you are the best. Y'all remember that. Y'all stay up and stay beautiful. I love you guys. It's gorgeous out here. All this new growth, beautiful future ahead of us. Let's keep living that dream, man. Oh, I love that shit. Stay up and stay beautiful. I'll see y'all around.